And a good day to you, Explorer Nation. John Linsky, your ambassador for alumni affairs here with season two, episode 11 of Did You Know? Fun facts about Columbus High School. Today, the time machine takes us back to the 2002-2003 school year, which was an exciting time to be at 3000 Southwest 87th Avenue. So, did you know? In July, Mr. Rick Pellegrin from the great class of 98 and Mr. Dan Sioka joined the faculty. Did you know Mr. David Pugh took over leadership of the National Honor Society from Mr. Pedro Garcia Casals? Did you know the swim team under new coach Mike Aguirre captured the district led by Randy King, James Snedeker, and Michael Guerra? Did you know for the third time in four years, this is impressive, Coach Riley's golf team captured the state title, thanks to Alan Pareda, Marco Morales, Tommy Surrey, and Greg Blackwell. Did you know, this was pretty cool, in December, Dr. Pedro Greer, great man, class of 1974, was named Hispanic of the Year by Hispanic Magazine. Did you know the soccer team went 19-5, and five. Alex Rodriguez was named all day. This is impressive. Did you know Pat Lee won the long long jump state title going an incredible 24 feet, nine inches? Pat was named Athlete of the Year, had a great football career at Auburn, and won a Super Bowl ring with the Packers. Did you know Alex Chomat won the prestigious Miami-Dade County Youth Fair Scholarship? Did you know Varsity Basketball won 19 games, led by Danny Rodriguez, Paul Marrero, Eric Diaz, and J.J. Valdivia? Did you know Mr. Keith Cooper, Coop, yes, the music man, organized a wonderful Mother's Day concert by the CCHS band? And did you know Coach Weber's baseball team, led by John Jay, Danny Gill, Alex Garabedian, and JoJo Gutierrez, won the 6A state title, the first major state championship in Columbus sports history. It's quite a quite a quite quite an event. Valedictorian Alan Sanchez attended graduation at Guzman, made his address, caught a flight to Tampa, and delivered two key clutch hits in the championship game. Brother Pat then distributed diplomas to the seniors at home plate. It was pretty cool. Danny Gill was All-State, the 6A Pitcher of the Year, had a great career at UM, while John Jay also played at UM, then spent over a decade in the major leagues, winning a World Series with the Cardinals. So the class of 2003 has a Super Bowl champ in Pat Lee and a World Series champ in John Jay. How many schools can say that? So... That's it for our journey through the past. Uh, join us again real soon for the next edition of Did You Know? And until then, buenos tiempos and adelante, boys.